what is best in life? Well, today we join uh, Sheikh Alandin the Cruel, uh, Sheikh of Kuvir, Sheikh of Alamut, Sheikh of Gurgan. I've reconquered my capital at least, and am, a, and am attempting to uh, conquer some lands down in Zabulistan, exterior to the Caliphate, as the Caliph has declared realm peace, just as I was on the cusp of recovering Karakum. Uh, I'm losing seven gold pieces a month, uh, which is expensive, but I'm going to try to maintain one of these bands of mercenaries. Uh, I think it's still a little cheaper than hiring them anew, and my chancellor is frantically trying to develop a claim on Zabulistan. I'll get the game playing, although I'll slow it down. And last episode, a child was born, Reza Jaws. Uh, he's a demon spawn and i will legitimize him obtain it touched it says he's he's a bastard of my dynasty i want to legitimize him though it doesn't look like i can and i'll see if i ever get the opportunity to i don't know why i can't now i'm tempted to a try attempted demonic possession so that i can uh control him and prevent him from killing off all his family members which the last demon spawn did killed if you'll notice killed over half of my children um, died in their cribs and died of horrific nightmares because the uh, other uh, demon spawn daughter was killing them off and I have a sister and her husband and I've lost all of my alliances Yes, I've lost form alliance. No one is interested. I'm not powerful enough as a non-sultan to form an alliance with. So right now, I don't have weaker claims that I can uh, project. The Liege is informed realm peace. And like I said, my chancellor is down in Zabulistan uh, trying to develop a claim. Now, are there any claims that I can use possible inheritances uh, a land and a land and a land and Nazi the kingdom of moose jaws is vacant so I would have to kill off all of these people at least before and this is just a city before a land and elg would inherit and is this just a city as well no, this is the Sheikdom of Kurdistan. Where is Elg in this uh, in this inheritance line? That would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people I'd have to kill off. Hafez. Well, who Hafez? H A F E Z. Is that a member of my house? Hafez, courier, and he's a Persian. And what title does he hold to? Uh, is this the city of Sanda? Durek Pat of Quivir? Yes, it's the city of Sanda, but he's my Durek Pat. So he wouldn't even necessarily, that uh, holding wouldn't fall to me. Uh, Jemalaya Jahan daughter. So she's actually my daughter. But I would have to kill off one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people to get her claim established. And... Master of the Blade of Croatia. These are other claims. Sheik Alandin the Cruel. Now these are ones. If I could... That is an empty title. So, but I would have to kill off the Caliph before it would come back to me. And the Caliph is actually holding this one. 
and I would again have to kill off the Caliph and all of these people before this emirate would return to me. And... These titles are far away from being none of them. There's none of them. Can I only assassinate a couple of people and have them return to my house, even though I lost them all just so recently? A land in Elg. Heir to the Emirate of Kurdistan. And I tainted touch the Emirate of Kandr Kurdistan, but he only got syphilis which will kill him eventually, but not for, it could be decades. And it doesn't even say he's uh, killed now. Uh, news from China, the pr people of the Khaganate probably never knew why the eminent emperor chose to attack the Khagan Burga. Regardless, they've suffered a crushing defeat and their Han armies are journeying home to celebrate. Their victory has been declared. So I wonder how the uh, wider world looks like. The Western Protectorate is established here. Tibet is i don't believe tibet is under the surazi of china surazency oh tributaries maybe it is kaganet of kaziria kaganet of the uyghur high chiefdom of mari high chiefdom of muria uh kaganet of Sibirid, uh bozak kaganet emperor of turkestan uh Barkhanderik Kaganet and the High Chiefdom of Kremesia. So that is not the Bajamin Kaganet here, is it? This is the Sultan Hazan of the Bajanet Sultanate. Actually, I should try to snag him. I'll, can I go to war with him? I can't. I don't have... I lost my claims. I just need a Casa's belly and I could get him. So I will move my chancellor up to grab it before somebody else grabs China and legalism my legalism dropped down it was at two when I was a sultan now it's at one and a half or one and three quarters and I will try to let it grow in naturally and I'm growing zero points I guess because I'm not a sultan I'm not gaining any technology points anymore in my laws, my inheritance is agnatic seniority, which I believe is good. That's the seniority I wanted. My cousin, my son, captain. Oh, yes, and I did form the Quiverian band. So I do have a mercenary band that should be sending me some income. A land in Jaws, here it is. Uh, oh, monthly cost, 0.89. There's only 103 of them. I'll send them more troops. Why can't I send, has not, oh, I've got raised standing troops. Um, may you live in harmony and contentment. We would like you to batter plot to kill Wally. Yes, I'm accepting plots now. I have no logic for my accepting plots. Now, my military is accepting standing troops, but they're mercenaries, so... But I guess just because I have mercenaries on retainer, I can't beef up the uh, troops of the mercenary company. Form alliance. Uh, one child lies. Lars childhood focus. Playful intrigue. Willful. Actually, uh, sure, I'll give him an intrigue focus. My grandson. And see if there is Princess of the Tibetan Revolt. So there's no one with a title for my grandson. Is there someone with some good genetics? Oh, here's a 12-year-old. How old is he? He's 12. She's 12. She's a genius. Let's get her married. 
And yes, I'll torture someone. That seems to be the daily refrain. And I hope they accept my uh, marriage proposal for the genius. And I will lay low as another member of Lucifer's own has been apprehended. How many Lucifer's own people are there actually? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. So there's about a hundred of us. Now, do I still have the mission? No, I don't have the unholy impregnate someone. However, I'm going to try to do that again. If there are any uh, court, if there are any more women, my kinswoman, she's still in jail. Can I unholily impregnate her again? I could declaim poetry. I could sacrifice her to emit to her. Um, demonic possession. It seems like I've lost the, because I lost the mission for Unholy Impregnate, I lost the uh, tooltip for Unholy Impregnate. But I thought that uh, as the head of Lucifer, Lucifer's own, I had the skill, yeah, the power of Unholy Impregnation. Uh, on the right-clicking the portrait of a female follower of Ariman in order to summon a demon who can father an unholy child. This can be used on yourself or on others if they are a mission target. Uh, no, I don't want to. I won't torture my kinswoman. Resist my foul impulses. I just realized I'm actually castrated, so taking her as a uh, concubine isn't going to do me much good. Now, Farah Gurgan, my cousin. <coughs> Let me see if there is. There's just a 68-year-old woman of my house, designated regent. Uh, I followed Stuart Hafaz at a distance when I saw him meet two rather rough-looking men and went with them uh, into a tavern infamous for its shoddy clientele. I watched at the dirty window how money exchanged hands and had the evidence I needed. Hafaz was working with the thieves. My Durek Pat, throw him in jail. Uh or gain the trade arbitrary, gain 50 gold, I'll gain the 50 gold. It's the Middle Ages, I'm sure lots of people... Okay, so here are people outside the realm. Princess of Moose Jaws, oh, they're 48 and 47, just out of childbearing age. Oh, here's a 36-year-old, but she is too far away. She's out of diplomatic range now. And she's a prisoner in Quivir, my kinswoman? Can I, uh... Actually, I'll... Uh, how old is she? She's seven. This one's 13. I'll try to demonically... Why can't I demonically... Oh, she's a bastard. Can I legalize her? And she's betrothed to my Derek Pat. She's 15. I'll attempt a demonic possession on her. And then why can I not get her into Lucifer's own? Perhaps because she's not an adult? But anyway, I will... I prepare the ritual to induct her into Lucifer's own. All 
right, I'll torture my non-relative in the... Uh, The ritual was a resounding success. Zora seems to have taken quite a liking to me and is far more amenable to my suggestions. The unfortunate side effect is she has become quite obviously insane. Why is she still hating me if long reign, no murder? And make her a special interest character? Yes. Oh, it's, she's betrothed to uh, the court physician, too. I hope I don't screw her up too much. She's just a loyal servant. And she's possessed. Now, if I can recruit her... I guess I can't recruit her until she's another year, until she's 16 and old enough to be inducted into Lucifer's own. Then I'll try to unholily impregnate her as well and get another demon child in our dynasty. And the caliph, the two caliphs are fighting each other. Caliph Hussein, Hussein and the caliph of Arabia. So I guess Mulhalabid and Abbasid are at war. While carrying out the duties, my duties for Lucifer's own, I have met Abjur and Nafisa on several occasions. These encounters have never ended well. One would be hard-pressed to find a more unsympathetic character. I suspect she is spreading lies behind my back to damage my reputation. Uh, I will confront Nafisa and reveal her dishonest ways to the world and becoming rivals. I will be patient. It will pay off in the long run. I'll lose 150 dark power. Uh, no, I will reveal her dishonest ways to the world. Oh, I was going to taint and touch her. Why can't I? Well, I can't plot to kill. She's not within diplomatic range. So hopefully she can't plot to kill me either. And we're back, as life just briefly interrupted us there. And uh, what do we have to do? There's not a lot going on. We'll get the timer going again. Um, we're just waiting for the Chancellor to develop some claims. And I have an open council position, a steward. I need to be making some money. So, well, nine is the best I can do for the uh, steward skill. Get him collecting taxes and Gurgan, my capital. And my Grand Vizier disappeared for... And uh, I'll make the court physician also... Oh, my Grand Vizier was probably killed. Well, it's a risk to uh, the court physician, but I need him anyway, so I'll get him fabricating claims and Bajanid and betrothed can marry. Looks like there's a lot of betrothed can marry. And Caliph Mizra has instituted the absolute rule law in the Arabian Empire. I think he's eliminated the powers of the council. And I can falsely confess faith, which is something I'm seriously considering doing. I think that's uh, going to be necessary to uh, survive as a Zoroastrian is we're going to have to falsely confess our faiths. However, I'd like to reassemble as much of our Sultanate as I can before um, falsely confessing the faith. So I'm still losing seven gold a month. And I guess I'll speed things up a little bit as there's not much going on. And did I try to uh, I'll lay low for Lucifer's own? And yes, my kinswoman, can I, now that she's old enough, can I recruit her for Satan? Yes, it looks like I can. Now, her opinion of me, even though it's loyal service, a loyal servant, because attraction to hunchback negative 30, cannibal negative 10, so she, per, uh, she prefers cannibals over hunchbacks which is something. Attraction to eunuch, negative 20. So I'll give her a bribe to increase my 
uh, I have a new heir. I will play as a Landon of the Quivarian Band, my son. All right. And now I will try to recruit for Satan. And I sure hope I can because she's one of the few chances I have of doing another unholy impregnation. But uh, she's not in jail or anything. It seems that, that my words only irritated my kinswoman from the steely look she finally gave me. I should steer clear of her. That's disappointing. That's really disappointing. It looks like they have to actually be in prison for me to have enough influence over them to have them join Lucifer's own. And these are all the women of my dynasty. They can't be all the women as uh, Zohair isn't listed. Oh, there she is down there. She still just has her child portrait. Uh, should I go torture? Um, how old is Walia? She's 50. Sure, or she didn't survive. So I could have another demon spawn with my prisoners. There's only one prisoner left. And that's Parvin, but she's my kinswoman. For some reason, she's... All right, her I will try to uh, demonic possession Parvin and see if I can unholily impregnate her. In the middle of the night, we begin the ritual. Uh, I sense I am about to unleash a being of terrible power upon my unsuspecting foe. I will do it. In my court, a man. My Mobad. Oh, actually, quite a talented Mobad. A daughter was born to a Landon Elg, uh, my granddaughter. And yeah, we'll try to give her conscientiousness. Oh no, I failed to recruit her for Satan. Can I do it again? demonic possession I can only attempt it once it looks like it doesn't time out that is disappointing so I'll have to wait and see if I can recruit her for Satan later and my granddaughter um, assigned guardian matrilineal marriage to try to build up the uh, house And there is someone who's attractive. The Jaws are not necessarily an attractive line of people. And the Kagan. Oh, the Kagan. Can I get a... And actually, I think I am going to, seeing as I have the opportunity... Oh, this is falsely, secretly practicing the Zoroastrian religion. Convert to my... Leisure's faith, and let's just make sure my leisure's Sunni. So the Caliph, yes, is Sunni. And under the intrigue panel, yes. Even though I now publicly proclaiming the greatness of Allah, I will still hold my Zoroastrian ideals in my heart. Praise Ahura Mazda. So I wonder if that's going to carry any water with the caliph uh, I'm a known murderer and a cannibal but I'm no longer an infidel I'm still a foreigner and my wolfiness is uh, coming back uh, tearing slashing gouging all the while howling like a wolf you are in the end the panicked squealing stops blood I kill the pig Oh, who hasn't? And for some reason, my gold has gone... Oh, I had 25% decadence. That's it. Uh, I wake in the morning and I feel an exhilaration being covered in blood. Martial effects plus two. And an invite to plot to kill Hormuz. Sure, I'll join that plot. Kisa's host. Stay away from me. You're too big. Oh, she's host. So what intrigue options does that... Can I go on a Hajj? I will go on a Hajj to Mecca. 
seeing as that there's not much going on at home. My child comes and asks if he can come. I will bring him along for him with me. There will be an, a regent ruling Quivir when I am away. Onwards to Mecca. And my aunt is the designated regent. A group of bandits are tracking us, and it seems as if they are gaining on us. Attempt to avoid them. It is our duty to stop them. We will engage the bandits. Uh, charge. We will attack, see if we survive. The camel, one of our companions, is riding on, collapses on the sand with a grunt, never to rise again. You could take turns with your companion to ride on your camel, but that would slow you down, and the unforgiving sun would have to be endured a while longer. Here, use my mount for a while, lose one health. Uh, terrible luck, friend, see you in Mecca. I will loan him my mount and risk my health, which is a risk, as I believe I have all sorts of other, I'm stressed, I'm a lunatic, I'm possessed, I have health problems. Uh, as you stop for camp one evening, you notice that an old man in poor clothing has made camp at the same place. The man offers to tell you a hadith if he has, if you can spare him some bread, I will listen to the old man. The old man says that Abu Haraya heard the prophet say when Allah decreed the creation, he pledged himself by writing in his book, which is laid down with him, my mercy prevails over my wrath. And I gain one stewardship from that wise saying. And hopefully my decadence will be reduced. As I arrive in Mecca, I start preparing for the evening's prayer. When I discover the water in the well is not entirely pure, this would be not be valid water to use for ablu ablations inform others nearby i'm now at the kabbalah and performing the tawaf seven circuits you walk around the black stone and each time you complete a circuit you point to the stone and say in the name of allah allah is great allah is great and praise be to allah so do i want to be proud or humble monthly piety plus one or monthly prestige i will be proud <coughs> Excuse me, and uh, I will lay low uh, as a member of Lucifer's own uh, to symbolize the mercy of God had for Abraham and replacing his son Ishmael with a ram, which Abraham then sacrificed. We perform the Id el Al while at Mecca. Sacrifice a ram, sacrifice a lamb. Uh, I will sacrifice a ram. My decadence isn't going down. As you ride through the desert on your way home, you pass the grim remains of another pilgrim caravan. Their bones have been picked clean by scavengers, and it serves as a sobering reminder of the dangers associated with the Hajj. You consider yourself lucky to have made it as far as you have. We will soon be home, inshallah. A son was born to uh, my kinsman, to Morad Bahurid, and so I'll name him and I'll give him a martial education. I have returned to my court a changed man. I am truly humbled before Allah, and I know that all men are equal and can live in harmony with each other. So I am now Hajij, and monthly piety plus five, plus, or month Muslim opinion plus five, and a bonus to my piety. And my regency has ended. And now what sort of marriage can I acquire for this? Oh, here's a genius. And I will betroth him to a genius. And come on, steward, crack open, uh, or uh, chancellor, grand vizier, get me a claim on Bajanid so I can go to war. And my decadence remained at 25%. Monthly decadence gained zero. Perhaps I need to spend some time alone, seclude myself in prayer. 
Well, something happened. All these sultans. The sultan must have gone to war. My regency. I resolved to be a better man. 25, 10% chance of gaining temperance, temperate or diligent. And I gained neither trait, unfortunately. Well, it looks like that's the uh, it for this episode. Uh, not a lot is happening as I don't have any claims and the Caliph has declared internal realm peace. So I'm rather stuck. I did go on a Hajj to Mecca, which is kind of interesting to understand. And I did falsely confess a faith, but uh, I'm still one of Lucifer's own, although I'm now a Muslim. So hopefully the Caliph won't deprive me of my titles quite as easily as he did the last time. Uh, if you enjoyed the episode, uh, hit the subscribe button and the little bell so you get notification of my other videos. And uh, I hope you had a good day. Thank you.